Okay, I'm going to use the RGB function to change the color of the form. color so when I click on this button I'm gonna set the color of the form using the RGB function so it's form one dot color function name or rather the procedure name is RGB it needs three values okay the first one I think is red then green then blue Okay, so it should have a value between 0 and 255. So let's start off by testing only 10, 10, 10. So when I click on the button, it's going to change the color to those values. Okay, let's change them to 100. a little bit lighter okay so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna add a timer and every time the timer goes off I'm going to change the color of the form so the timer is set to one second by default so I'm gonna say RGB need three parameters let's use the random function random for red um, let's make it two five six then it will pick a random number between zero and 255 and random two five six for the green random two five six for the blue so now it changes the color of the form selects random values for red green and blue to change the colors I'm gonna comment that one out as well and now I'm gonna add some scroll bars I'm going to use three scroll bars so that the user can select let's say the first one for red second one for blue and the third one for green let's just add the label this one is for red This one is for blue. I mean green. This one is for blue. RGB, red, green, blue. Uh, let's make this one the caption. Red, green. And blue. Okay, so the user will be able to pick his own settings. I'm going to change the settings of the scroll bar, mini max value, min zero max 255, max 255, for the last one 255. So the user will be able to scroll between zero and 255. Okay, so now I need to put the coding under on change so every time the scroll bar is going to change I'm going to set form one dot color to the current settings of the scroll bars so I'm going to say RGB okay so the first one is scroll bar one dot position that's for the red and then I want the current settings for the scroll bar 2 dot 
position. So it's going to get the position of the first scrollbar, this one here. It's going to use it for red. It's going to get the position of scrollbar 2, this one. It's going to use it for green. And then the third one is scroll bar 3 dot position. So it's going to use the third scroll bar this one over here for the blue setting and it's going to happen every time I change scroll bar one so currently it's only going to work when I change scroll bar one it's not going to change when I use scroll bar two so I need to put this coding under all three scroll bars so when I change this one that coding must also be applicable. When I change the scroll bar 3, it must also change the current color of the form. So now it's on a scroll bar 1, 2, and 3 under the change. So every time the value of the scroll bars, one of the scroll bars change, it will update the color of the form. So you can switch manually okay, and that is a few ways you can use the RGB method